they will face Mike Soroka for the second time. It's often said the most difficult thing Jeff for a pitcher to do is face the same opponent in back to back starts. That's the challenge for the native of Calgary Canada. And there's a hit right on cue. The coaches were talking about Bichette last night after the game and they said I bet she gets a hit in the first two pitches. They were one pitch <laughs> off. It was the third pitch. This one's off the end of the bat into right field. Joyce broke back but recovers and Mike Soroka escapes the first. When they will face Jacob Waggis back looking for a bounce back outing today his last uh, start was against these Braves. It was a very emotional series for Josh Donaldson up in Toronto his first games back as a former Blue Jay. Swing and a high fly ball that's wallop deep toward the Braves bullpen. Teoscar looks up it's gone. The bringer of rain has the umbrella out on a sunny day in Atlanta. It's two to nothing. That's got to feel good against your own team after not getting one up there in Toronto. The bringer of rain. There's the umbrella. And he goes dancing through the dugout. His teammates showering him with Gatorade and sunflower seeds, bubble gum. One of the greatest, most heartwarming stories of the year, Bobby Cox returns to SunTrust Park today. And he just got McKinney to swing and miss for the second strikeout of the day. Two outs. And Soroka makes short work of Waggis pack. 0 2 pitch. Breaking ball. See you later. Nasty hook. That is the third strikeout for Soroka. As we know, with Soroka, there has been very little stress and certainly none here in the third inning with a couple of strikeouts. Four in total. One away. He's going. First pitch. The throw is going to be on, the on target, but late. And Albies on the first move has his 14th stolen base. Bases are loaded. And Hansby Swanson's the hitter with the Braves trying to add on to a 2 0 lead. And the pitch he is grounded to the left side. Ball booted. Balls into shallow center. And Donaldson's going to try to score. Throw to the plate is late. He scores standing up. Drury couldn't make the play. It deflected into shallow center. And by the time Toronto picked it up, Albies and Donaldson had scored and the Braves get a break to extend the lead to four to nothing. The batter is Randall Gritchick with a one one count. Gritchick struck out against Soroka in the first inning and gets a high breaking ball hits it deep to left field get up and gone. Randall Gritchick with his 24th home run of the season has cut into that Braves lead. It's now 4 1 Atlanta. Swing and a miss struck out Hernandez. Strikeout number five for Soroka. Swing and a miss on a change up. Almost twisted him into the ground. Nice pitch by Soroka. So Rowdy Telez will bat for the pitcher. Take a waggish back. Telez hits it high and deep to right. And this one's going to go. His second pitch hit home run of the season. Home run number 16 for Rowdy Telez. I'm telling you, that young man has tremendous power. You come off the bench and you're ready to swing the bat. There's a drive to left field that's going to hang up for Ortega. The shed will go back and tag. He'll come in to score. And all of a sudden, it's a one run game. Randall Grichik with his second RBI of the afternoon. Josh Tomlin takes over in relief for Mike Soroka. As Teoscar Hernandez Jaws took strike three. Second time he struck out. Tomlin's sixth inning's off to a good start. Another strikeout. Boy, he's painting. Hernandez and McKinney caught looking. Two up, two down. Ground ball. Adam makes a nice play. Good throw to second return throw in plenty of time. Boy, what a nice double play started by the pitcher, Jason Adam. That'll hold these guys down and get a little more offense going. Braves are winning the game with just two hits. And this one skied into shallow right center. Who wants it? It's going to be Acuna who calls off Joyce, and that will send us to the seventh inning stretch. So back to the top of the order, Ronald Acuna Jr., the center fielder, has been hitless in his three at bats. And he strikes out. Boy, a big strikeout for Tapera. He got him. Tapera ends up with three strikeouts, and he's able to get around a walk, a stolen base, and in the air. Shane Green takes over on the mound. As we told you, Jeff, he is on a very impressive scoreless run for Atlanta. Ten consecutive appearances without allowing a run. Swing and a miss. Boy, there's a devastating breaking ball. Green just took care of Biggio. Former Angel, former Cardinal, and current Jay. And a liner to Donaldson. Check the webbing, Josh. A screaming missile speared at third off the bat of Richard two out. Margot batting from his more powerful side right handed one two 
Swing and a shot headed for the corner. Did he get it up? He did. A line drive over for Camargo. There's some insurance. Brian Sitker pushing all the right buttons in game one. Mark Melanson now is on to try to finish it off. Boy, he's been extremely impressive. And on three pitches, Hernandez strikes out for the third time. And a swing and a miss. This is getting fun, folks. The Braves are an out away from a potential six and a half game division lead. He struck out the side. What a way to finish with a flourish. You talk about immaculate relief pitching. The Braves' pen covers four innings in perfect fashion.